I'd like to show you a little bit of rasqueados, which is that fancy thing that flamencos do with the hand that everybody likes. Um, there's many, many different kinds of rasqueados, like... Uh, also, there's... And then there's also... And then there's also... So as you can see, these different rascadas have different uh, degrees of intensity and different colors and different rhythmic effects. So from all these rascadas, I'd like to focus one, on one particular one. And uh, I kind of call it the flicked rascado. And uh, you can use it with four fingers, but I'll just focus on the three finger one because it's easier to do. Uh, so what you do is you have to have your thumb a little bit bent in like that, the tip of your thumb, the last joint of your thumb bent in so that you create a sort of ramp, I call it a resistance ramp. And when you put your fingers behind the thumb like that, you can easily create some flexion, some a little bit of tension and power, which then you explode onto the string, and that's how you make a nice, strong, percussive sound. So, And now, the, the final part of the raschiato is the upstroke which is the connector, so that you manage to make a rolling sound. So it's... So for example, if I'm playing from the fourth string down, my thumb should be leaning on the fifth, and I have a nice high level attack and approach onto the fourth string, and I can release the fury of the fingers right on these, on these strings here. separately first, just kind of get a roll going, okay, and then once you have the rasqueado, you can actually do this lick which I'm going to show you right now. This is a very, very basic rhythm groove of solea por buleria, which is a, a very cool flamenco form, it's not too slow, it's not too fast, it has a very groovy kind of vibe to it. So. It's in 12, and I'll, I'll count it off for you. The accents are on 3, 6, 8, 10, and 12, or 3, 7, 8, 10, and 12. So that's kind of how flamenco works without getting into too much detail. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 9 chord, we bring our thumb down because we're playing from the 5th string down, and it's same pattern in the right hand, 4, 5, 6, again, 4, 5, 6, let's just do those two. Parts. 